I'm at the foot of Mount Fuji in Japan. I'm at the Fanuc Open House at the Corporate HQ. Now I'm with Mick Estes. Now Mick, uh, this open house is, it's a large event. We're featuring a vast array of technology here. We're looking at robotics. We're looking at machine tool controls and robo machines. This point. And are there, is there a specific industry trend that you've noticed this year in particular? Real industrial applications for collaborative robots mm -hmm. are, are really taking precedence and artificial intelligence. Uh, we have, uh, Hispanic uh, development engineers have really uh, expanded the use of artificial intelligence for the factory floor, and we're seeing all that here today at the open house. Now, Mick, it's, it's common these, these days to talk about Industry 4.0. Uh, industrial Internet of Things. Uh, we're going to connect everything. It's going to be Ethernet connected. The blue wires in the ceiling are gone in the factory at this point. There is is connectivity. We know it's the future, essentially. But is is the real push going to be in connectivity for the next few years? There, or are we going to go down the collaborative road? Does it all fuse? It's a, it, it's all getting fused together. And actually, the future is here now for the connectivity. Fanuc is uh, continuing to show uh, their field system. That is. Uh, becoming is expanded is including the use of our uh, other unique products into the field system for fanic so it's not just about the robot and the fanic products but other companies products being used within the field system how about on the machine tool control side we're, we're entering a world now where it's getting harder and harder to find skilled people qualified people and uh to know g-code is a great thing but uh, there are some who say the future of machine tool control is to basically make the control so intelligent that you can essentially easily train what we usually consider to be a less educated or less formally trained employee is that the way the, the industry is going to go Ease of use is a big, big focus of not only FANUC, but the whole industry. So, and as you mentioned, the workforce is changing. And as it changes, we're finding a workforce that's coming in to uh, the automation world that is very, uh, captures the intuitivity of what they've grown up with. And so now we are seeing our products become more intuitive. So you don't necessarily have to understand GFS codes in the machine tool area or how to program a robot with specific code. We're making it so that the ease of use takes over and launches these new potential users of robots to a much different type of environment than what has been uh, experienced over the years. Mm -hmm. These days, is the trend now to sort of buy a complete solution in one package? Would uh, would, would a customer come to, to Fennec and basically say, look, I want it all. I want to basically go from, from, from I want pick and place, I want machine loading, unloading, I want EDM, I want I want a, a probe in there to quality check. Is, is that the way this thing is going? Yeah, and, and Fennec is in a unique position to be able to offer all that. Um, not only is it the robo machines or the, the, the controls for the CNC machine, but it's also having a robot to complement all those applications. And then having the software, the different software products. So when you look at things like we talked about field a little while ago and artificial intelligence, incorporating that with the FANUC products allows us to offer a complete solution uh, to the end user. Now, uh, I come from a manufacturing background myself, and I come from an age when essentially uh, you would be an Allen Bradley house or a Heidenhain house or a Fanuc house. And once you went down that road, it was very difficult to get your equipment to talk to anybody else's equipment. And so the tenders are narrowing you down. Uh, others say the future is going to be mix and match all across the factory floor. Your opinion? That's exactly why we have products like Field that will come out that will allow us to include everything into the overall factory uh, manufacturing environment. Nobody gets left behind and with products like Field. The community has to be able to easily integrate all these various products, whether you have Field or not, but into your standard product offering, you have to be able to accommodate all these varieties, called the Heinz 57, if you will, of the automation world into a consolidated package. Is, it, is this going to be affordable in the future, this level of sophisticated automation? Oh yeah, uh, it is right now. And uh, if you look at high mix, uh, uh, low volume high mix, it's there today. You know, we have many companies that are doing small lots of manufacturing, easily switch over to another uh, product and have it manufactured on the same line at the same, at the same rate. So that, that time is now. Mick Estes, very bullish about the advanced technology we see here today at the Fanuc Open House at the foot of Mount Fuji.